going on guys <clears throat> drones and dogs here welcome back to the channel so we're gonna be running this armor granite guys 4x4 the 550 mega but it's been upgraded and I upgraded it to the brushless so it's got the brushless system in there it's got the 3100 kV with the ghoul RC two to three S lipo in there. What's up, yo? So, plug this guy up. And we're gonna get this guy a run. See how it runs on this Ghoul RC. I think it was about $40 for this setup. It was the 3100 KV and the Ghoul RC ESC, 60 amp waterproof ESC. Wasn't too bad to change this guy out, so. We're gonna run it on a 2S LiPo. We're gonna run brushes, guys. So welcome back to the channel. Let's do this. Let me get this guy set up, get it all set up, and we'll go for a quick run. We're gonna be a quick run of this armor granite with the new brushes system in it. It's starting to rain, as you can see. So I just wanna get out here. This is with the 2S. I gotta uh, fix my steering a little bit. Hold on, let me fix my steering. My steering is way off. All right. Yeah, this is gonna be just a quick run. Look, it's raining, yo. So I ain't gonna be out here too long. I already can tell she's cooking. Look at that. <laughs> yeah, she's already sliding around. Ooh. But not too bad for a little brush. Not brush, but uh, 40 hours. Brushless motor and ESC setup. Little Goo RC brushless motor, 3100 KV. You hear them tires squealing. Yeah, 3100 KV, 60 amp ESC, so it can support two to three S lipo. We're running it on the two S right now. So we'll see. We'll do a follow up with a three S at a later date. Of course, of course, it's raining right now, so I don't want to be out here too long. Look at that, she's squealing. She's not doing too bad though. Ooh, a lot faster than stock out the box with the little 550 brush motor. And I wasn't bad with that 550 brush motor, but it just wasn't enough speed for me. Now that's, that 550 brush motor would be a, enough speed for a beginner, but as I've been progressing, I've been wanting a little bit more speed to tinker with, and I just I wanted to upgrade to that brushless. This is a little cheap little brushless motor that I put in this guy, so it wasn't too bad. Nothing too crazy expensive. Yeah, she's getting along pretty good though. Steering's off a little bit now. I'm gonna fix my steering just a little bit. I had to tweak my steering just a little bit. Get over here, where you going now? Yeah, she's cooking pretty good though on this uh, 2S LiPo. And this little 2200 milliamp hour LiPo. Moving around pretty good now. Woo! Brushless motor, guys. And to be honest, like I told you guys, I just recently got into the truck, so this is the first time I've ever put a brushless motor in anything. And when they tell you that this this armor granite is so beginner friendly, guys, it really is, because it, it wasn't too hard to throw this little brushless motor up in here at all. As you can see, she's cooking around pretty good. And I did take off the 14 tooth pinion the pinion gear and I put a 17 tooth yeah 17 tooth pinion gear in there instead of the stock 14 that it come with it's a 48 pitch 17 tooth pinion gear in there with a 3100 kV brushless motor by Goo RC guys all right I think out the door for the whole setup was less than 50 bucks and that's with the pinion gear the brushless motor and the ESC the brushless motor and the ESC came in a combo together and then of course I ordered the pinion gear separately Pinion gear was like four or five bucks. Nothing too crazy. Yeah, guys. But it's raining. I ain't gonna be out here too long. I just wanted to see how this thing runs with the new brushless motor in it, and it is cooking, yo. Full throttle here. Full throttle. Full throttle. Woo hoo! Definitely gonna have to get a uh, GPS speed. Woo! On that tarmac, she's cooking. 
Just gonna have to get a GPS speed test out of this thing now. I never did it with the stock motor, but I already know it was only going about 19, maybe 19, maybe 20 with that stock 550 brush motor in there. But as you can tell, this thing is definitely cooking now. If I had to guess, I had to say, I had to say it's doing maybe 25 to 30 right now with this 2S LiPo. I'm not sure. I'm gonna just say maybe 25, maybe maybe 30. I don't know. But this thing is moving. Let me see. So I'm curious to see what that 3S LiPo would do. As we swinging in the rain right now, yo. I'm a granite. Was the 550 Mega? Now I guess you can say it's a, it's a, uh, it's slightly a VLX. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> it's a VLX now. Yeah, man. With the new brushless system running in, and this thing is running like a boss. Running like a boss. It don't even matter that it's raining. It's still gripping this, gripping this pavement real nice. And tires, the tire compound on this thing is real nice. As you can see with the pavement all wet, it's still gripping around pretty good. It's not doing too much sliding in there and it hasn't tipped over yet. Alright, we'll do a couple more passes before we bring this guy on in. I'm having so much fun with it, man. I'm a granite baby. Woo! Proud of myself. My first time putting a brushless motor in any RC truck. Now I feel like I got confidence. Armor gave me a little confidence. I feel like I could do another one. <laughs> the boy felt like he can get a little technical now. Yeah, it was really easy though, guys. A couple screws and some bolts. Just slapped this little brushless motor in here and it was like nothing. I might, I'm thinking about, uh, now I still got the stock servo in there. I did not upgrade the servo. I may do that at a later point. I'm not too sure of how, I, how far I really want to go with upgrading on this truck, but I, we'll see. Definitely going to try with a 3S though, and see how it cooks on that. And he didn't strike, I think that battery's done. Hi guys, so that was a quick run of this Armor Granite. It was only on a 2200 milliamp hour with LiPo. Quick run of this Armor Granite, you know, 550 upgraded to the brushless system. Hope you guys like it. I'm your boy Joe the Dog. Appreciate it if you guys like and subscribe. Catch you in the next video. Go